Hey, another uh, piece of pineapple. Is, uh, did that regrow? I feel like that regrowed. That's pretty realistic. I'm all about nature and all that stuff outside, so I think that I really do appreciate the fact that the ecological system is a uh, biologically correct here, very accurate to a real life depiction of what it's like to survive out here on a, on a raft in the middle of the ocean. Oh my God, is he is he done with the bait? Oh my God, am I gonna run out of oxygen? Oh my. Hey everyone, how's it going? My name's MBR and welcome back to Raft. I've made a terrible, grievous mistake. I can't believe I've done I can't believe I've done this. I messed up in this game. I did not know that to get the scrap metal under the island, you just hold your hook instead of just trying to throw it. Thanks, comment section down below. Thank you very much. Be sure if I showed your name here, if I mentioned your comment in the comment section, if you told me that the scrap metal was underneath the island, you used your hook, leave a like down below because I'm. Sh this is a shout out to you. Th thanks. Seriously, guys, either way. Welcome back to Raft. I'm really trying to expand my Raft here uh, in a very purposeful way. Everything here has a purpose. Nothing here is being spent willy-nilly. Every piece has its part. You may think that I'm just a madman with my architecture, but no, no. That has a destiny soon to be foretold in the ancient waters of the Ikea Ocean. I called the Ikea Ocean the first episode because you literally can get whatever you want out of it, but then you can, because you can build it. Never mind. Y'all are too young for that IKEA crap. All right, let's go underneath the water and see if I can get some of the uh, the scrap metal here by holding it down this time. A freaking idiot. And sand, because that's as useful as scrap metal. Sand is one of the most precious resources of this world. Seriously, why the hell do I need sand? <laughs> oh, I probably needed to like make glass and stuff like that. Also, you guys also told me, by the way, also in the news, I need to put out shark bait when I'm uh, doing this thing just to be safe. So here, Sharky, take the bait. Yes, sucker. I'm gonna be safe forever. I'm gonna I'm gonna live forever. I'm immortal. Okay, let's find some more scrap metal. Cause that's what I really need. I don't need really much else besides that. Also something about algae, algae goop. I can get algae somehow. Can I go farther down? I don't want to go farther down. Nope, nope. That's that's subnautica stuff right there. Oh, seaweed. That's what I need. <gasps> there we go. I am a magician. It was the pot plants the whole time. That lasts for a long time. Look at his mouth. What the heck? No, good stuff. Pretty, pretty tasty. Nice little num num yum yum. He's happy. He's a happy little guy. You can tell by the way his tail is wagging. Oh, what a good little boy. Can I just stab him? Yeah. Does it just loop back though? By the, I'm sorry. I, there's just growth spurting out from this raft. I know, whatever. I mean, we're already making this raft pretty ugly as it is. It's fine if I just add little things here and there. It's all part of the aesthetic. It's what I'm going. It's abstract rafting. Oh Jesus! God, no! I make myself. Uh, oh, he's back. Okay, cool. He's back over the shark bait. I can go back down. Give myself some more scrap metal. Rinse and rip. I should probably be doing it as fast as possible when I have a shark bait out. By the way, why was there a muffler? Oh, giant clam. Ooh. Can I cook a clam? Is that what it's for? Did I even grab the clam? I wanted a clam. I went down the bottom of the ocean to get clam. I come out without clam. I got a muffler instead. You eat so much a day, by the way. Can we? Can we just? Talk about that for a second. G same with him. I feel like I eat at least like 40 potatoes a day. It's, it's getting kind of ridiculous at this point. To create another shark bait, we need a big fish, a palm frit, or a herring. Do I even have a fish? I haven't fished in a long time. I've been just stocking up on my potato. I have the clam. I'm a big fat idiot. Whoa, that's a big one. I, I could tell by the way I touched my pole. Yeah, it was a catfish. Very diverse set of wildlife out here in the, in the ocean. It's quite beautiful, actually. You have tilapia, you have barrels, you have potatoes and sharks. It's a full circle of nature. That would really suck if he could grab my pole. Came out wrong. All right, one more shark bait. Uh, I don't exactly know if there's anything underneath the island still, but I'm, I'm gonna just check it out anyways. What is this, by the way? I wanna know what this is. Some sort of rock or like ore? Copper. That's probably important. I craft a thing underwater. Am I okay? I'm, I'm probably fine. I'm probably just, just fine. Just fine. I'm, I'm just fine. Oh God, it's hard to breathe. I think that uh, kind of spends that spot. I don't think I can get any more stuff until I go down further into the actual uh, 
the depths and find, you know, a, a kraken or something. I, I don't know what's down there. Hey, another uh, piece of pineapple. Is, uh, did that regrow? I feel like that regrowed. That's pretty realistic. I'm all about nature and all that stuff outside, so I think that I really do appreciate the fact that the ecological system is uh, biologically correct here, very accurate to a real-life depiction of what it's like to survive out here on a, on a raft in the middle of the ocean. Still trying to figure out the best docking system, though. Uh, I didn't see any of those comments in the comment section. It was mostly about, uh, you know, just harvesting the materials underneath the island, but uh, I'm, still, I'm still waiting. You know, you can tell me when, whenever you're... You're good and ready, okay? I should really put my potatoes closer to my water system or have just a bunch of water systems by my potatoes. One of the two needs to happen. So let's check to see if I can make scuba gear yet or what I'd need to create scuba gear. So we need vine goo. How do I make vine goo though? I could have swore that someone told me you cook it on the fire. I wonder if there's something else that I need to like, I don't know, melt it with or something on the research table. Hopefully I don't have to smelt it because that would, that would, Damn it, that would suck. Give myself one of those, uh, what is it, John Mayer? John, no, George Foreman. I almost said John Mayer, what the hell? You know what, I see a raft over there. I'm gonna check it out real fast, uh, cause last time I, I, I didn't get to check it out that, that easily. I sunk it. I sunk the last raft I saw. There was a survivor on board, and I took their stuff and I sunk their ship. Very Sea of Thieves like. There's more stuff here. It's a bird's nest. That's interesting. Okay, okay. I don't think that they're meant to actually stay above water. Like you take their stuff and then it's it's just gone. I want I want to have a mango farm. Those things are sick. Or a pineapple farm, actually. That'd be great too. Except I might uh, might end up getting the poops, little poopsy poopsies. You have to have a balanced diet. You know, one day have potatoes, one day have fish, one day have mango, one day have pineapple. Maybe like a cheat day with plastic bottles or something like that. I found a metal ore. <gasps> I found a hinge. Does that mean I can make the big storage now? I'm gonna flip dippity dip dop right now if I can. Yes. What is the clam research? Oh, I can make a bird's nest out of a clam. Why didn't Why didn't I think of that? That I found a shoe. Maybe I can plant something inside of a shoe. I guess I'm just gonna put all my collectibles like right over here. I think that's that's the plan for my my spot. I find a lot of stuff when I'm. Uh, I hear you. Don't you dare think I don't. That's right, you stupid little bird. That's right, I'm gonna eat you up. You know, the raft over there, that one's a bit bigger. I wonder if there's like more stuff on bigger rafts. I'm not entirely sure. I've only had two opportunities to search one, but they both sunk very quickly. So I was not able to really explore around it at all. All right, it's time to eat our chicken dinner, guys. Wiener, wiener, chicken dinner. Oh, that's so good. I can get a shoe potato. I got a shoe potato. <laughs> All right, there you go, little guy. Grow big and strong for me, okay? Got another shoe. I have a pair now. Yes, things are looking up. All right, it's time for me to stop messing around with my potato farm too. I need to. I need to make a bunch of purifiers right now. Oh, that's a weird looking island. I want to go there. Let's do that. Land ho! It's tiny. It's so small. <laughs> this is the best island in the world, <laughs> right here. So big. As you can tell, I'm a very organized person, by the way. I just want to really, really strike that that into your brain chasm. That I'm incredibly meticulous in my planning. Incredibly, incredibly organized. I'm really hoping to get vine goo. I'm not, still not entirely sure where it's from. That, is that vine? Is that vine? Where's the vine? I need the vine. This vine? Seaweed, more seaweed. What does vine look like? I need vine, please. Where's the goo? Where is the goo? That is a- that's a vine! That's a freaking vine! Alexa. Google search vine goo in Raft the game. I- I got a person I'm not sure for this. what you're looking for. You can see- It comes from seaweed. It comes from sea. How do I get it? I need to use a smelter to make vine goo? Are you joking with me right now? For a smelter, I need a dry brick. And for a dry brick, I need clay and sand. My one shot. I'm gonna throw the shark bait over there. I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna find me some freaking clay if it's the last thing I do. Stone. Okay, I might have to go deeper, maybe? I, uh, clay. Look for something that looks like it could be clay. That looks like... Could that be clay? That looks like sand. Pretty sure that's probably just sand. Clay! I got clay! We need one more. It's worth the risk. Uh, Go! That got sand. It was just normal sand. Damn it. Shark is still going on the bait. Okay, we got a little bit more time to go down. 
One last run. Is that clay? That looks like it could be clay. Clay, let's go. Let's get out of here. I think that's enough. Oh my God. Is he, is he done with the bait? Oh my God. Am I going to run out of oxygen? Oh my God. Okay, I'm good. I'm fine. It was fine. So now, if I'm correct, I don't have enough clay. All right. Hopefully I get enough clay this time. I'm going to throw this out. So I think that the clay is just slightly darker, I believe. I believe this is clay. Please be clay. Thank you. I really don't want to risk it. And shark bait's easy enough to get. So I'm just going to make my, my stuff right now and see if I can actually progress just a little bit. All right. So uh, wet brick, sand and clay. Gotcha. And then supposedly you place it on your deck to dry out or something like that. Just take some, take some time. All right. So we just literally watch something dry out in the sun. That's our, that's our entertainment for the day, I guess. Fun. Well, it's nighttime and it's, uh, still, still not, still not dry. And it's, um, it's morning time now, you know, and, uh, it's still, uh, Still not dry. Do you put it by a fire? Does that help? Okay, so, oh, dry brick, finally. It's finally here. The moment we've been waiting for, guys and girls. Oh my God. You need six dry brick. Okay, that, all right. What, no, what the heck? You're glitching things out. I'm gonna ax your face off. That's my sale. I'm not trying to fish him, no. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for me today. I hope you all enjoyed it. Leave a like and a comment down below if you did. I'm gonna rebuild my sail in just a second here. I don't know how he was able to manage that, but that was insane. Wait, do I have enough wood to create a sail to get out of here? Oh, shit. Uh, this took actually quite a while and I didn't realize how much brick I actually need to make the smelter. So that kind of just sucks. If you enjoyed it, again, leave a like and a comment down below. I'll be sure to subscribe for more videos like this one in the future. And thanks again for the support on the series. It's been phenomenal. It's still a fun game, even if it's frustrating at times and monotonous tasks and stuff like that. At least I get things that lighten up the mood like this. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. And remember to keep having fun. Bye-bye. I'm a Mar